Hey honeys, it's Ams. Welcome to my channel. So today I am partnered with Dola Hair and I'm sharing some of the goodies they sent me. Gave me a razor, also an edge wrap to lay my edges, a edge brush, and of course some wig caps. I just took the hair out the box. This unit is 14 inches, 180% density, and it is brown with honey blonde highlights. Also, as you can see, it has a tighter texture to it, so it's tighter curls, and I really like it because it's so curly like and bouncy. It's like a crispiness to it. By the way, this is a bang wig, so as you see, there is no lace, and let's get to the construction of this cap right quick. I feel like bang wigs are so beginner friendly because you don't have to worry about any lace. So you can see there are three clips on this wig and that's going to be enough to secure it. And also they have the straps at the bottom where you can adjust the wig to fit your head better. So the cap seems like it's going to be pretty snug. Now I'm going to go ahead and put the unit on. Okay, and even though there is no adjustable band, this cap is snug. Like, I don't feel that it's going anywhere, so that's perfect. The bang is great. Sometimes if you don't want the bang too far in your face, you can always just scoot it back just a little bit. A bobby pin, if needed. Put it like right there, like on the sides. Like it put it towards the sides and stick it in. Okay, and here's the second bobby pin. Just putting it right there so I can have some good placement so it won't even shift. So this is basically if you want to have the bangs further up off of your face where you don't have to have it like down here in your eyes. You can move it anywhere you want because this is just put it on and go hair. That's what I love. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and define the hair. I have my water and my Lotta Body Mousse, and I love this mousse, like I use it all the time. It smells good, and it does when it needs to be. <laughs> and I like to get this soaking wet because it will take the product better. So about two pumps to start off. So just go down slow, making sure that the ends clump up. Yeah. Using a t-shirt to scrunch the curls and then get rid of some of this excess water. This in the hair. One thing I know is that when I use the t-shirt to scrunch the curls, if I do it like in the drying process, like the curls look so much more just bouncy and defined. It's so pretty. So now my hair is all 
defined and it looks look at this wet texture okay I don't want to touch it too much like I said because if you touch it too much your hair gets frizzy Okay, so my hair is about, it's like an 85% dry. So I'm just using my comb to pick out the hair just a little bit, make it a little bit bigger. I really like big hair, y'all. I love me some big hair. Curls, the hair, everything is just giving me life right now. I'm so impressed with this unit right now. I'm so impressed. Like, you see this color? I'm going to get close so you guys can see this color. You see this color? This hair is beautiful. It's like a 3C texture, too. So, you know, sometimes it could go either way. The hair could be tangly or anything like that. Especially because this hair is color treated. Like, I wasn't sure what was going to happen. But, like... It was perfect. I'm gonna show you guys how much shedding I had. Like I've said in many of my videos before, any curly hair you have, you're gonna experience some shedding. So this is not bad at all. I like how soft it is. I love the fact that it just seems so defined. Like I just, only thing I use is mousse. Like that's it, that's all I had to put in this hair. Only kind I could say is Possibly because this hair is color treated, you can run into some tangles maybe over time, like more tangles, things like that. But other than that, right now, it's giving. It's beautiful. So I definitely recommend you checking out this brand. Dola Hair, y'all did something with this. Y'all did this one. You can't tell me this ain't my hair. Nope, but I'm gonna show you guys the back. Let me know in the comments below, would you rock this wig? What you think, sis? Also, if you do decide to purchase, please let me know that as well because I wanna know your thoughts about it too. Thank you so much for watching this video and I'll see you in the next one.